one time when I was in university, I told my friend, I said, you better send my number. You better take a picture of me. I'm going to be a superstar. I didn't even know, you know what I was saying. I was just saying my own. But I spoke it to the universe. Everybody here has something to offer. I can't do you guys' job. You think I can hold a camera like that guy? No. But a lot of people don't realize they are because in Nigeria, you being special depends on how much money you have. But people don't know their wealth is in their skill. You know I could bring out of my boots. Can't tell me if it's true. I don't really know what you're looking for. Yeah, yeah. Push up. <laughs> ah, that might be. You don't know. That might be. Even the full shower. Yeah. Are you ready? So here's what I told my boss when he wanted to sign me. I said, if you don't sign me, you're going to be making a really bad decision because I'm different. Oh, my is good music. I've had governors call me because of your mayor. I mean, I sat across Dangote. Yeah, well, and saw that. Yeah. And like, because of KISS, isn't that good music? That's good music. I actually, I saw Dangote twice in a row. Yeah, I mean. Right, yeah, because of. Back to back. Back to back. So isn't that good music? Mm. Well, your mayor was a song that was from the bottom of my heart sincerely. I was just in my car driving to graduation. And on my way to graduation, I was listening to a song I had. So I called the producer and I said, send me the beat. Because the beat was so spiritual. So I told the producer, send me the beat. And I just started freestyling in my car. And that's how your mayor came, came out. It just came from me being very grateful to God for everything thus far. You know, for me, even being able to complete the program, it took me seven years to graduate from here. Yeah. Side stuff. How much be yam? 100 now. Yeah, bring one yam. How can they be done me? No, be you now. Of course, we do something. Good side stuff as well. But do you think marriage is like the ultimate, most important thing? No, it's not. It's just, it's just the final stop for two guys that love each other. I mean, after marriage, what else? I believe that as a Kolai, which means that. Everything is time. Timing is very important in life. I like to enjoy my life to the highest, fullest volume of the highest. I learned when I dropped KISS. I learned something very vital. If you want to keep making good music, you cannot think about making a hit song. You just have to make good music, period. You have to have that juice and that mindset of, I just want to make good music. I don't know if it's a hit. If it's not a hit, if it's a hit, we thank God. If it's not a hit, we keep trying.
Amen. Amen. People received it well. But I feel like as Kamaya, well, God just said, you know what? Boom. Just take. And it just went like that. It was not just one of those songs that just came out and boom, it hit. It took time and it crept in. By the time Askamaya blew, I was living in America. They were telling me, oh, your song is blown in Lagos. And I was like, what? So by the time I came to Lagos at the airport, people were like, Ala Mogi Askamaya. So I was like, wow, okay. But with Amen, it was mostly just social media. It was just people from 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 social media so it was my transition from social media to real life i feel like that's that's the transition from amen being just a song people knew from social media to askamaya being a song where everybody just knew and then it blew up in london like like crazy like wildfire Sir. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Nice seeing you yesterday. Thank you, sir. Nice to meet you. Well done. Yes, sir. All his classmates in Zoom today. Yes, sir. But I'll, I'll call you. I'll let you know the exact time when I enter. Okay, okay. Thank you. Yeah, hello. Yeah. I'm not sure she's a doctor. She's a teacher. I was trying it. Ah, maybe we're supposed to try this thing first. <laughs> I suppose wait. <laughs> Make for short time, please. I grew up with me, my my friends have always known me to be a very stubborn person. I do what I want to do. Because I just realized from a very young age, who care? How long am I going to be on this earth for? I need to enjoy myself. I need to do as long as I'm not harming anybody, I need to do what's best for Tenny. I'd rather fail doing what I want to do than fail doing what someone told me to do. So, hey, I just went for it. I'm comfortable in what I'm wearing. I mean, if I was wearing like all these tight things, I won't be comfortable. So I said, you know what? I'm going to just attack music being myself. And to God be the glory, here I am. Rent go kill it. Even though my voice is gone. 
Yeah, I didn't even notice that. Yeah. Greatness is a thing. It urges you to what makes you wake up in the middle of the night to write a song. I believe I'll win the Grammys. I know I'll win the Grammys. I'll, I'll win the Grammys and I'll sell out stadiums around the world. I just know, it's it just in my soul. I want to make sure that by the time I'm dead and everybody gathers around me to sing me goodbye, right? And I'm like this. And they're singing, it is well. I would know that it is really well. And I lived my life for myself. And I didn't live my life for anybody else. Don't you worry about a thing. If you